This journal page starts on a spread that I've already scribbled on and tested some markers already on. And I'm just going to cover all of this. I'm taking some fluid matte medium and I'm going to just cover it with some papers from an old book. Next, I spread on a coat of gesso. And yes, I do like to use my fingers as it helps spread the gesso well. Next, I add some flexible molding paste with a stencil. I've got some older paint sprays and spray bottles, but you know, sometimes they just don't work. So I end up pouring out some, spraying on others, and just giving it a nice coat of color. Well, all of my layers aren't dry yet, so I'm going to just kind of pounce and try to get off some of that uh, excess paint. But when I do, it uh, really lifts it off. So it kind of shows the flower stencil where I used the molding paste. So I'm grabbing some white paint and I'm adding some just some lightness through a, a little uh, stencil. This is Punchinella sequin waste. I want to add a few little light spots around in my page. So since I have some white paint on my palette, I'm just going to go ahead and really, really roughly uh, paint on the raised areas of the stencil. The stencil was a flower stencil, so I'm just going to paint uh, just so it's more noticeable. Now I add some strips of paper scraps um, all the way around to add a border. Now I add my new purchase of the Posca, Posca paint pens. Uh, these are markers of paint and just outlining again roughly the flowers from my stencil. Some more marker details in black. Now I'll write out with marker my sentiment. Near, far, wherever you roam, in my heart you'll have a home. Then I'll outline it in black so you can see it a lot better. and a little highlight with white and we'll be done.